Greetings all. Diana here for Sagittarius' Daily Oracle Message. Oh my. Okay. Whoa. Sag. Spirit has a couple of things to say, I guess. Okay. Do that. And then we had these three come out. And then what are you over here? Okay. So. Sagittarius, the first message the spirit wants you to hear is that you are not alone. Isolation, physical net connection, community. Well, you may sometimes feel like you are alone and you don't have friends, support network here in this physical realm. You have an entire team of spiritual energies, entities, deities, people from the past worlds, past lives that are here to help you and connect with you and guide you. You have to call upon them and activate their energy in your life to have them influence you because they cannot do so without you. But the earth itself is activating. Mother is waking up and coming back to her own and her power. And this is causing a great shift in everyone's energies. If you have started on your awakening journey, you have been feeling this. And you may have a double mission, two things that you are to do here. Using my mother as a personal example. One of her missions here was to be a mother to me and my brothers. Three very different children that grew up to be three very different adults with three very different purposes, but still something great that will cause so much change. Another thing that she was here to do is to share her own story. So you may have a double mission of things that you, should, you will do in your life. Something that may be involved with it is karmic relationships. This may be relationships that you had in a past life that left an energetic debt that needs to be paid. And that is what karma is, is energetic debt that must be paid. And it is not something that is coming to attack you. It's not something that's coming to destroy you. It is just something that needs to be done to create a, to create what is right in the world. If you feel called to the path of spirituality, uh, the energy of things like tarot readings, oracles, Schumann resonance, Reiki's, things like that, if you feel called and drawn to it, Follow that because that is your intuition trying to guide you to where your soul will serve the best. You may have gifts in those abilities. You may have mediumship gifts. You may have energetic manipulation gifts and like you are a very good Reiki healer. These are things that up until a couple of years ago were very natural in our world. Gifts, blessings, abilities from the gods that was nurtured and harnessed and encouraged and welcomed up until a couple of years ago. So come back to the purpose of your soul. It is, it may feel spontaneous, but I promise you that this is something that your soul has been working on for a long time. So loosen your grip if you have been hanging on to the reality that you once had because it was a lower vibrational reality. See the potential in what you can do now. See the potential in what you can do and create. Bring unconsciousness to light. The unconscious part of your soul, this is your shadow that you have suppressed because you felt as though it was wrong. Bring it to the light. This could be memories, trauma that may be related to your karmic relationships. These are things that need to be come to light and brought to peace because there is so much that is for it. Your life will be a beautiful, sweet treat with endless possibilities of opportunities that you could have. And exactly what won't leave my hand right now is love. So lead with love. Exactly. I am right-handed, so this is what I shake with, and it would not leave. So I will extend the hand of love in all situations. Oh, wow. You have both the tokens of your male and female ancestors. So again, spirit is here to help you, to guide you, to help heal the hurt that your heart has gone through, my love. And I understand we have all gone through pain and hurt and suffering in this world, but you are still worth so much, and your ancestors are there waiting for you. And though it may seem impossible, it is true that you can cause this great shift in your life. Yes, do all things with love. You can be the protector of your tribe. And build a life that you want. And spirit will celebrate you for it. Because you are a beautiful, beautiful star child, my love. So Sagittarius, remember you're a blessing, remember you're amazing, and remember you are endless. 
speak to your ancestors, connect with your spiritual gifts, and you will create a huge change in your life to something that you never thought possible. Have a beautiful day, my love.